What's up everybody in the YouTubes? Welcome back to another video I, or episode of uh, Turn About Sisters and Professor Attorney channel. We just finished up with uh, the first trial of this case. And now we're going to the investigation part of the day, you know. September 7th, 3.11 p.m. Deten detention Center, Visitor's Room. Well, hello! I didn't expect someone to visit me in such a dank place as this. It's really quite moving. <laughs> Not! You stinky lawyer! I hope you die! Have you come to laugh? Yes, laugh at the fall in this May. No, not really. There's something I wanted to ask. Unfortunately, there's nothing I want to be asked. Haven't you done enough questioning, you spiky head? Really? That's the best insult you can come up with? Here we go again. Please, you're scaring the security guard. So, what was it you wish to ask me then, huh? For starters, how did how did you get to be true, so true, totally whacked? About the man who stayed with you in your hotel room. Can you tell me about him? Where is he? Come on! No way, Jose! Uh, maybe if I had something to get her to talk. Why did you place a wiretap in Mia's phone? Aww, when you say it like that, it sounds so cold, so criminal. Uh, tapping people's phones is a crime this morning. Oh, and I suppose you were in the lawyer school, huh? Creep. This woman is impossible to talk to. Say, why are you so angry? I mean, you don't look like a bad person. Bottom? I can't tell. Does she have a thing against lawyers or just against me? Hey, guess what? Actually, I uh, really hate your guts. So get lost because, uh, well, I'm not cooperating. Thanks, I noticed. I guess she says the same thing for all the evidence. The thinker... The wiretap... The badge, the ops ops in Maya's phone, the receipts, the testimony, and the floor plans. So I guess we'll get out of your hair, Miss May. Cause we're not getting any, any information out of you. September 7th, Fane Co. Law Offices. Looks like the forensics is taking the day off. Detective Gumshoe is nowhere in sight. The police really gave this place a working, a working over. A working over? What's working over? I guess it's like a once over. 
I doubt there's any valuable clues left. Suppose it can't hurt to take a look around, though. The sky is blue, and so am I. There's that hotel right across, right across the way. Mia's favorite potted plant. I guess I'll have to water it now. An old movie poster. Apparently, this is, was the first movie that Mia cried, that made Mia cry when she saw it. I have to check it out one of these days. No clues here. I was checking the the lamp on the desk. Mia's desk, perfectly clean as always. The only thing it's missing is. Mia. You couldn't cram more illegal books in here, I mean, even if you wanted to. All the cases that the chief worked on are filed here. Hmm. Are some of the files missing? Nah, I'm imagining things. I think the guy who uh, bludgeoned me, I took him. September 7th, Gatewater Hotel, room 03. Ah, oh, welcome, sir. Quite the performance today, if I do say, if I dare say so myself. Oh, uh, thanks. Sorry for putting you on the spot like that. No, no, not at all, sir. Your efforts today can only help the Gatewater's rep. As they say. Huh? Rep? Yes, our reputation will swell as the hotel as the hotel where the murder murderer used a wiretap. We can charge a premium for the room, of course. It will be great for business, sir. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Miss May hasn't been charged with murder. I, too, will become famous. The bad boy who brought the murderer iced coffee. Why do I feel like we're both stuck in the same bad dream? So, you are our honored guests. Please let me know if there's anything I can bring you. About Miss May. Oh, huh? Sir, no need to boast, but the moment I saw her, she, she do what I said. Do what? I'm starting to think the most suspicious person here is this guy. Is this guy who went, I know. I wanted to ask you about the man who was with Miss May. Oh, yes. He struck me as a real lady killer, if you pardon the expression. I knew it from the moment I saw him, so. He and I are both from the same age. We both carry the sense of danger. There, there we are. There we are in a total agreement, Ms. Mr. Psycho Bellboy. If you had a photo of the man, I'm sure I could identify him. A photo, huh? Could you tell me about the hotel? Absolutely. On that subject, I have an excellent idea, sir. Currently, this hotel is known as the Gate Haunter. I propose that we add a, a subtitle. Subtitle. The Gates was a hotel. Murder Manor. Well, what do you think? Uh, sounds great. 
Whatever, whatever floats your tea, sis. I'm sorry. All I could think about during the trial was the hotel. I wasn't paying much attention to the evidence. Yeah, that I'm Tatsy, Maya's phone. I wonder when we we're going to talk with Grossberg again. Okay, see you later, dude. Or can we uh, examine the hotel room? A bottle and two glasses just on the table. Why hasn't he cleaned things up by now? Oh, I beg your pardon, sir. But if you could please refrain from touching those. It's possible that they call. I call it the last drink before murder. You'll be famous. I'll talk the talk of the hotel industry. Nice weather again today. I can see the faint call offices, of course. Oh yes. You plan to install the telescope a telescope in that window, of course. Just five dollars, but I need three minutes of a view to of a view to a pill. Just kidding, sir. <laughs> By that look in his eyes, I'd say he was more than serious. <sighs> I still seen painting. Wait, shouldn't that be still life? Whatever. One of the one of those is hanging on the wall. A vase, as expected. I'm not good with flower names, except maybe tulips and sunflowers. And the bed. A simple bed. It's been recently made. Nothing like catching here. And the phone camera fell. Huh? There's still a screwdriver stuck in, the, in that drawer. Oh, please leave it that size is so. That is the drawer of terror, H hiding place of the murderer's wiretap. It's also become one of the most popular attractions here. This guy's serious. I don't believe it. So I'll see you later, bro boy. It's good. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No painting. Where's the painting? September 7th. Grossberg Law Offices. Huh. Looks like Grossberg is out today. Again. Maybe he's avoiding me for some reason. Shouldn't do it. Expensive looking mahogany bookshelves with expensive looking books. Hmm, funny. They don't look like they've ever been read. 